hey guys it's been quite a while since i vlogged but um yeah today is my good friend davine's wedding and so i'm just doing all the last minute prep to go to that right now um i am i bought her um some gifts but then i also handmade um some stuff i got a frame and i'm doing uh, i printed off or i wrote out their first dance lyrics um i mean i'm gonna put it up into a little frame and then i got these little maps of where they met where he proposed to her and where they're getting married so um i have to do all that i have to go to the store still i have to take a shower and i was supposed to do all this yesterday and i've been feeling like complete garbage so that's that explains this um but just gotta keep going <laughs> Um, oh, what is going on with my focus? But yeah, anyway, so got lots to do, but you will see a little bit of, a, of the wedding today. So I'm going to go do the things. I feel a lot better, even though I don't really look it. Sorry, don't mind me. I'm only half done here. Um, we went grocery shopping, ran errands. I have everything all ready to go, just need to put it together and I need to wrap the presents. And then my brother's family is coming over because today would have been my dad's 66th birthday. So every year on his birthday we get ice cream cake and we sing happy birthday to him. It's just one of our little traditions. So we definitely had to make time for that. So they are on their way here and um, yeah, just gotta hurry up and put these together. So let's do some good old YouTube magic. getting ready before we have ice cream cake all right guys what is that cake for grandpa gary for grandpa gary yeah are we gonna sing happy birthday to him yeah. okay right. you gonna sing happy birthday to grandpa gary too <gasps> that's good. That's good for him. all right guys okay one two three happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Grandpa Gary. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Wait, where's the candles? Who's gonna blow them out? You're terrible. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, who's gonna cut the cake? Uh, you want Uncle yeah, Russ to cut the cake? Huh? No, I typically mess up. It was your dad who was talking. Uh, Mommy! Josie, you want to cut the cake? <laughs> With my handy uh, knife skills. <laughs> yeah. Well, don't let Carissa, she'll slice her hand open. <laughs> Alright. That's cool. That's what I remember that uh, fighting movie I was watching. Just cut it? Just yeah. One of, one of the more tiger claw is the movie. No, mine is that. His opponent said cat's paw. I said. So, you get it? Oh, what is that, cat's paw? I'm better at winning. Maybe strawberry or gum, bubble gum, or maybe cherry, or maybe whoopie. Yeah. Who's the one you want to get All right. And then we'll do some little ones for the kiddos. Yes, but yes. not right now. I'm gonna Hi, Queenie. My <laughs> first and Queenie's next. Okay. <gasps> what? 
Focus your attention on the main entrance to the reception area. It is my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Linstead. Sunday evening now about five o'clock I didn't pick up my camera for the whole rest of the night or the rest of today um, just spent the morning kind of running some errands and lounging around the house doing nothing because I just felt like garbage um, but anyway so yeah I showed you um, just some clips of the wedding which was cool um, the ceremony itself was unplugged, which I've actually never come across before. So it was, you know, very interesting um, actually having that. I've seen that's like a new thing that people really want to embrace, like enjoying the moment and, you know, not being a distraction and all that stuff. And as somebody who documents everything, like that part was like hard for me because all I wanted to do was just get pictures and videos and capture that. But... I mean, from coming from, you know, the couple's point of view and everything, it was, it's totally understandable and I totally respect that and, you know, even though I, when I do take pictures and stuff at weddings, I try to be just as discreet as possible and I never get in anybody's way because I would never want anybody to get in my way if I'm trying to, you know, watch a wedding, but, um, you know, I definitely wanted to respect their wishes and I put my camera away 
but I did get some other stuff of the rest of the ceremony. So I, I mean, of course it was really sweet seeing them, you know, do their first dance and everything. And then um, afterwards they did the father daughter dance and it was um, that one country song, um, There Goes My Life, which that's already like a sappy song. I hear that and I'm like, oh, you know, but yesterday, would have been my dad's birthday so i like i lost it i was you know i got like a p i saw people get like teary-eyed and all that kind of stuff but i lost it i had to excuse myself and i went out to um the outside area and i actually ran into one of my coworkers, and i was sitting there just a bawling mess and she gave me a hug and i kind of just explained a little bit of what was going on immediately afterwards there was this dragonfly that that flew right in front of me right, right when I went to go sit back down um, after the song was over. Um, and I didn't, hadn't seen any dragonflies the whole entire day, the whole rest of the day. But there was one that was there and I saw it for the next like five minutes it was just flying around. So I thought that was cool. Um, if you don't know the whole, I don't know if I mentioned the story of the dragon of dragonflies and my significance to them with my dad on here, but basically when we were cleaning out my mom's garage after my dad had passed we were joking around that there was this one dragonfly that we that just kept bothering us like for like three days me and my sister were just cleaning this garage out and there was this one dragonfly that kept showing up and i was like oh yeah you know blah 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 it's it's dad he doesn't want us to get rid of his stuff so you know he's coming back and so when we chuckled about it and then it wasn't even like that was in the beginning of the summer and then later at the end of the summer we had a garage sale and brought all that stuff to my house which was at a different location obviously and the whole entire weekend that we had this stuff out for a garage sale there was a dragonfly and so every time you know i see a dragonfly i just think of my dad so there was that and i thought that was kind of cool all in all it was a beautiful ceremony and I am so happy for the couple and I wish them lots of luck, lots of love and lots of happiness. So um, I don't know if I'm gonna vlog anymore tonight. Um, I actually have a couple of vlogs that I'm behind on so I might work on those. So I think I'll just end this here. Um, sorry, this was such a boring short vlog. I'm not really in a vlogging mood so much lately, but I try, I do my best. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye. So I was sitting here talking to the camera and I did not know that my mom was just hanging out in the backyard. Say hi mom. Hi. <laughs> she was just sitting there. She heard everything. And there's my cat. Alright. That is all. Bye bye.